ladies and gentlemen <coughs> welcome to Rogers Kakasungura YouTube channel I have always said and I will repeat myself that uh, the constitution of Kenya not by choice but it's a must commands the office of the executive that is national government the office of the president the office of its deputy and anyone in the executive led by the president to act as symbols of national unity Kenya is a country that has come a long way in terms of freedom of expression and freedom of speech kaka i am a sad man tonight but again i'm not that too sad because whatever i saw or whatever i had it's not by surprise it is expected because the person speaking this is well known in character Kenya <clears throat> the time to nag the media died long time ago and by the way i am specifically directing this video to the deputy president regard the gashawa that your today's sentiments the bullets you fired at media are uncalled for and they should be condemned by all means humanly possible you are now taking us back to 1940s almost over 50 years ago that is where you're driving us back to when kenya is fighting hard you know kenya is a developing country when we are fighting so hard to be a developed country the leaders we have trusted with power but of course according to raila they are illegally in power these are the people who want to kill the efforts kenya has made in the past over 50 years of independence freedom of the media is something that cannot be negotiated freedom of the media is not something that can be backed for this is a constitutional right the media is just a vessel you cannot or i want to find the most relevant example to drive this point for instance awezi ukapasua kikombe kwa sababu chai moto iliyokuwa kikombe ndani imekuchoma sio shida ya kikombe kikombe is just a vessel so media is just a vessel through which information passes media is a voice to the voiceless media is an eye to the blind so when the media says that william ruto has not achieved his promises where is the lie where is the lie so regard is standing in public and wants to kill the freedom of the media this is sad 
and should not be allowed anywhere in this country. It means when you are crippling the media, when you are nagging the media, when you are gagging the media, it means you are going against the constitution that you have been put to protect. Freedom of expression. Freedom of the media. So when Rigardi stands in public and says Nation Media Group belongs to Azimio, that is an unfortunate statement. Accept correction, accept positive criticism. That is when you will be a competent leader. A leader who hates criticism is a dictator. So in short, Rigardi is a professional dictator and I have no apologies to make. You cannot dictate the media on what it should write. Fulfill your promises and the media will write about it. Yes. If you are serious about your government, fulfill your promises. Lower the cost of living as you promised. Regard you yourself, you promised to increase police salary. What happened? And you are here abusing the media. You yourself, you are on record promising the police to increase their salary. Immediately you put the Bible down. What happened? When the media is nothing about it, munasema munachukiwa. Regardi and the president, you are on record saying there are cartels in petroleum industry and once you put the Bible down, you will deal with them so that the cost of oil can come down. What happened? When the media is writing about it, you are angry and you want to are able to do what? Tuambia ni ukweli. Unasema uwe ni mtu wa ukweli na mimi sasa nataka ni kuambia ukweli kashawa. Yes. Fulfill your promises. Na hakuna mtu atawafuata. Eh. Ninyo wenyewe from your own mouth. Mlesema immediately you put the bible down. Unga itakuja paka 70 shillings. What happened when the media is writing about it? Munasikia vibaya. For the first time the cost of salt is rising. When the media is writing about it, munasikia vibaya. Where is the lie? Whatever nation media wrote in their papers is as true as, as it is. The nation media group put it in black and white without even hiding a sentence. But unajua, ukweli unauma. So kama ulikuuma, it means nation media group spoke nothing, 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 nothing but the truth. Kama umeumwa to a next and you want to respond one on one as you did today, it means ilikuuma sana. Na kama ilikuuma, uo ni ukweli wa maneno. Askari sa hii wanalala njia wanangoja mishara. What happened? What happened? What went wrong regardi? I'm asking you as an individual. Now, you are here telling us about stories, you are here, telling us about paying the judiciary that helped you in the election, you paid back. Yani, unatuzia judiciary yenye munalala kitanda moja na yo. That's what you want to sell to us. At the 20 promises that William Ruto has fulfilled. Nini mulishama mutaweka pesa kwa mifuko ya mahasala? Ni nini ilifanyika? Instead ya kuweka pesa kwa mifuko kwa mahasala, munataka kuchukua kupitia high taxes. Media ikiandika, munasikia vibaya. Halafu munasema, nini ni viongozi. Ladies and gentlemen, I want to play for you regarding the shower's clip. What he said today. Nyinyi watu ya media, Nation Newspaper. I want to address you today because I think it's a time to call you out. 
to the run-up of the general election in 2022, you join Azimio to run a campaign against President William Ruto. You carried fake opinion polls, you, nation, showing that Raida Odinga will win the election. The people of Kenya ashamed you. You ran fake narratives every day that William Ruto is not electable. The people of Kenya told you off. You started another campaign of another lady from Kirinyaga, a headline at the mother effect. Kura ikipigwa, Raila alipata 47 votes, hapo mgubo primary school, iyo mlikuwa munasema mother effect. You ran a narrative that once Rigali Gashagwa has been elected, has been nominated as running mate, William Ruto atapoteza kura. Tukakuja, tukanyorosa nyinyi, pamoja na azimio. You seem to be living in denial. You have not accepted that the people of Kenya made a decision and elected William Ruto as president. Today, shamelessly, you wrote a headline on the failed promises. You never even looked for one paragraph to say what the president and his government has achieved. I want to give you 20 issues that the president has achieved for your tomorrow's headline if you can be bold enough and objective enough to tell the people of Kenya the truth. Na hiyo project yenu ya azimio hakuna bahari itaenda. Muna jaribu kumujumu huyu rais wetu. Mulishikana na serikali liondoka na azimio kumuharibia rais huyu wetu jina. Na kujaribu kukoroka wa Kenya and to incite the people of Kenya against the president. President William Ruto has been in office for eight months. He has achieved many things. More than 50% of the promises he made to the people of Kenya, he has kept. And he still has another four years and four months to keep all his promises to the people of Kenya. Listen to me carefully for your tomorrow's headline if you are objective and bold enough. One. Niwambie. Niwambie hii watu. Hao watu hii watu ya nation ni watu ya Azimio. And they are part of the Azimio campaign. And they are still living in denial. Listen to the successes and the kept promises by the president so far in only eight months. One. Ladies and gentlemen, anayo zungumza maneno haya ni kiongosi wa taifa la Kenya. Anyway, it's very unfortunate. It's very unfortunate. But, I want to tell Rigard Dilasha one thing before I conclude. The truth of the matter you should know. You can never fight the media and succeed. Never. Never. Regard. Never. Never. You can never ever fight with a pen and succeed. Instead, unajiweka mwenyewe katika shida na utakuja kujuta badai. Umona ruta ameenda pole pole kwa kupika media in person. Wewe ndi umeanza. Mimi na kuadvise kama kijana. Na kuadvise as a, a responsible Kenyan. Please, keep off the affairs of the media. Hii vita ya media, haweza ni, hauta songa hata tu maes, you cannot. Hii utapoteza bure tu. Yashawa, hii utaungua. Wewe pigano na Raila. Wewe pigano na kinauru Kenyata. Mamba ya media, utaumia bure tu. Mimi na kuadvise. Media, Utaumia, utataka mena tu bure. Haya, endelea tu. God bless you.